Welcome back everyone. Today we're diving into the big news about Borderlands 4 and the reveal of its new villain. Gearbox has confirmed that this isn't just another handsome Jack, but someone far more dangerous and sinister. This is huge news for fans of the franchise, and it could potentially take the series in a much darker direction. So what do we know so far? According to Gearbox CEO Randy Pitchford, this villain promises to be more menacing than any we've seen in the past. There's speculation that it might be The Watcher, a character first introduced in Borderlands, the pre-sequel. The Watcher is tied to the mysterious Iridian tech and could unlock a whole new side of the Borderlands universe that we've barely scratched the surface of. But here's where it gets interesting. This new villain isn't just about bringing in more chaos. It's about deeper, more engaging storylines. Gearbox has hinted that this character will have connections to the game's lore that could completely change how we see the Borderlands world. Imagine fighting someone who knows all the secrets of the Iridian past while wielding powers that dwarf anything we've seen so far. The big question is, can this new villain fill the shoes left by handsome Jack? Jack was charming, sarcastic and ruthless qualities that made him an unforgettable antagonist. But Gearbox is promising something darker and more dangerous this time around. Could this mean a shift towards a grittier, more intense storyline for Borderlands 4? As players, this raises some exciting possibilities. A more menacing villain could mean tougher boss battles, higher stakes, and a more immersive experience overall. We might also see some massive expansions in terms of gameplay mechanics and world building. Think more challenging missions and more dangerous environments that push the players to their limits. This villain could be what takes Borderlands 4 to the next level or it could risk steering the series too far from its chaotic roots. Are we ready for a Borderlands game that's less about comedy and more about high stakes, life or death confrontations? So what do you think? Is this villain the fresh blood Borderlands needs or is Gearbox making a risky move? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below and stay tuned for more updates as we get closer to the game's release.